Hello Docker developers, Jack Wallen here to help you make tech work. If Docker Swarm is your container cluster technology of choice, you're going to want to know how to scale up and down the services you deploy. When you need more power to meet a higher demand, scale those services up. When demand lowers during off-peak hours, scale them down. This is a great way to help keep costs down, especially when your containers are hosted on a third-party service such as Google, AWS, or Azure. You might be surprised to find out that scaling services up and down on Docker Swarm is actually quite easy. In fact, it's done with a single command, and you only need to change the number of nodes the service will scale to. As for the scalability, it is limited to the number of nodes you have attached to the cluster. For example, if you have 100 nodes attached to the Swarm, your maximum scale would be 100. If you have three nodes, your max is three. Let me show you how it's done. I'll demonstrate with a previously deployed service called nginx underscore test. Check how many nodes the service has been deployed to with the command docker service list. As you can see, nginx underscore test has only been deployed to one node. Let's up that to three nodes with the command docker service scale nginx underscore test equals three. You can then verify the service scaled with the command docker service list. This time it should show nginx underscore test on three of three nodes. When it comes time to scale that service back down, the command is similar to when you scaled it up, only we'll use one instead of three, as in docker service scale nginx underscore test equals one. And that's all there is to scaling a service on Docker Swarm up or down. Use this feature wisely to ensure your services can meet increased demand when needed. If you want to learn more in the ways of everything tech, be sure to subscribe to our Tech Republic YouTube channel and watch more how-to videos at How to Make Tech Work.